going on YouTube? It's your boy NTG here and welcome back to God of War Ragnarok. If you guys haven't watched the last episode, make sure y'all go check that out. We went back to Helheim with Kratos and Atreus. They reunited. You know, they made amends for Atreus leaving him for what Kratos did to push Atreus away. All that bullshit. But we killed Grom, or I think that's how you say his name. It starts with a G. Y'all know. Just go back and watch it. Um... But then he came back and he kept just healing and healing. So then Atreus put Fenrir's soul into Grom. And now he's just, Fenrir's just a big ass dog. So, yeah. I have no idea what's next. Hopefully we go kill Heim though because that's really what I fucking want to do. I fucking hate him. But yeah, without further ado, let's get right back into it. I'm going to study my notes on the mask. See if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. We back. Oh, we already heard this yesterday. I'm, really I'm going to upgrade my gear. I'll cut to when I'm done. Um, after, probably after this video, I'm going to, uh, hey, wait. do some side wait. missions. If I can upgrade Kratos more. And Atreus and Freya and all them. But that'll probably be off camera. I would speak with you, please. What you want? What is it you want? It has come to my attention that Nithog has been slain. And as a result, her offspring have been let loose into the Nine Realms. What of it? Unfortunately, without a proper role model to supervise them, the little rascals are certain to fall to mischief. In time, said mischief could culminate in nothing less than their devouring of the Nine Realms entirely. In order to avoid such a grisly fate, I'd like you to bring the lean worms to me. I believe I can act as a satisfactory paternal figure in their upbringing. You'll find the specimens gnawing on tears throughout the realm. Use this device to safely store them, bring them back to me, and I promise I'll make it worth your while. You mean to say you'd raise them by yourself? Indeed. I have no small experience managing extreme personalities. Compared to wrestling with my emotions in the most literal of senses, I dare say... Perhaps well, later. Any questions before you travel on? <clears throat> Alright, I just upgraded all my skills and stuff, and I got a new shield, so... <clears throat> yeah. Enough upgrading and shit. Let's play the missions. So we're we're going to Vanaheim again. We travel to Vanaheim. Great. You gonna check in on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. But yeah, I want to do some side what missions. The last time you were in Vanaheim. I still don't know how you got Freya to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed. She accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freyr's camp. You met Freyr? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. And he's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Wow. Beautiful. And, uh, wet. It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? No. Hey, is that soundstone on that log? I could get it past it. Freya's camp is to the right. No rush, is that? Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. Freyr's camp then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered. And there is much I owe her. <clears throat> mm. 
Oh, what they say? Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. What does it say? <clears throat> no one here. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. going on what the hell who is you Kratos Atreus a welcome reunion unexpected but welcome you know us can't be is that who I think Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man. Or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, tish-drunk, oversexed liar. You're just more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? Hilda Sveeney. Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh... I am so... so sorry about that. Freya's poor. Her advisor... and friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. Oh, I remember that. Shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. All right, we met someone new who's on our side, who's friendly. It's always a good thing. We can head out whenever you're ready. Hopefully, there he's friendly. Go. I have a favor to people, ask. people like to hold grudges in this game. So Traz did fucking shoot him. I remember that too. Freya was pissed. Where is Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Big Veer. They've been captured by the Ainher Yard. Oh, great. An ambush. Your presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy. Tracking time. In the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skoll and Hati, he'd be a fellow giant. Very well. Freya mentioned you had a way to Don't disappoint. Continue down this path and you'll find their dead. Good luck. And don't You're not coming? Anymore. You think he's really forgiven me for shooting him? Trust me, lad. If oh! swine still carried a grudge, you'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's all well and good. <laughs> but so is privacy. Huh? Okay, okay. Point is. <laughs> Bro, I dodged that, but all right. Oh! 
What is this, like the thing we fought in Midgard? The witch is making war of itself! Oh shit, bro. Can you use some health? Please, health. Move, move. Damn. Let's try this again. Mater mean. Sir. Vanaheim looks and feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Svartalfheim, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh, what? Egros. Greek. For you, it. Egros. I like it. Find the Nokis! Making this thing stronger! <laughs> <laughs> into Vanai means you've now visited each of the nine realms. Huh. Guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. 
Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. But I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. Well, that raises even more questions. Okay. Yeah, hack's over. I hear something walking. I can sense them up there. It's gotta be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hati, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. No, oh, well, there they are. Uh, hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves, supremely entertaining as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, guess we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. Right. The Aenor Yard played a part according to Skull and Hati's shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. It didn't say where they took the box. Hi, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? It's sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. Oh right shit. First. So besides Hildas Vini and the elves, who else is part of Freyr's army? Not much army, really. Although Beer Girl was a soldier, once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. Traveler that doesn't want to kill us. Ain't your head. I'm ready. Ne em Chop. Yeah. Careful, brother. You're covered in black rod. Get out of the fucking. All right, that was light work. Did you see that? I didn't know they could do that. A new enemy. Stay alert. Yeah? Correct. Hmm. Fitting.
There she is again. I guess they know we're coming. I can't believe no one's here. They hide. The Vanir aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. They're gonna be here. Watch. This is definitely an ambush. Right. Yes. in Odin's forces, at least for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. <laughs> Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay, yeah. That is a weird thing to say. Bro, double ambush. <clears throat> Didn't see that coming. Oh. Oh. Careful, brother. Cover the fight ball. Get 
Oh, I definitely hit her. <clears throat> that was easy. He's still up there. Another ambush? Really? Third time's the charm. They are not smart. I and does that. You know, what we're doing right now, all of this, it's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hati Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes. I remember the prophecy. So, doesn't it make you worried? If everything we're doing now happened in the Yonar Shrine? Remember our agreement. Prophecy will not dictate our actions. Yeah. Our allies need help. That is our focus now. sir. It's cold. Is this? It's from Helheim. Timed almost to grab this while I freed Garm. Uh, I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. Father, how are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the Giants said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. straight into Ragnarok. Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop them from... Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement. I don't even remember the agreement. Good points, though. As long as Atreus lives, so be it. There's nothing. Oh, 
Oh shit, they big. Just like inside their shrine. I do this. Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Slot. They have a gift for us. A way to call them anytime we need them. So they're on our side now. <laughs> we got big dogs on our side, literally. Got Fenrir, who's a giant ass dog now. We got them too. Feels like they want us to use it at one of the altars. Perhaps Freya will know. So in essence, they just gave us the keys of dust till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. We should head back to Hodespini and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the camp. Right after we fight. <laughs> Fuck off me. Oh, hit him. What you doing? Alright, now some normal enemies. I see that, Mimir. What a stupid ass plan. Where is the raven? All right. Come on. <clears throat> Come here, bitch. Light work. That wasn't the same one from earlier, was it? No. They come back fast. Not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well, all these Anhariar we've been fighting, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. I'm about to fight here, I can tell you. Yep. Come on, I was picking that up.
fucking ran. And they both stab his brains out. Light fucking work. Yes, they like the egros. Report back to Hilda's Feeney. Then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the light elf. Okay, but Odin's not gonna stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure, but if that mask offers all the answers... Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, father. All the plants here want to kill us? No. no. Only the canapsious ones. <laughs> no, we don't have that. mug belongs to Helka. She's a Flothunder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Well, he, will she love us? That's where I'm at. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Bela's already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. <coughs> the fuse is but 30 heartbeats. That's enough. 
Once you see the signal, count it down. Come, Kratos. We should get moving. The wolves gave us a scepter. They will answer, should we call on them. Good. There's a shortcut to Niord's temple we can use in daylight. The Einher Yara holding fair in your father's own temple. It's been empty for as long as I can remember. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Bigfear, the altars were once used to signal the wolves. And now we have just the scepter to do it. What is your plan? When we reach the temple, I'll fire off the beacon. A signal for Vela and Birger to set off their distraction. The Dark Elf Hive. Nice to not be on the receiving end of it for once. With their attention drawn elsewhere, you and I can assault the main force from behind. While Atreus and Hildesfini slip in to rescue your brother in confusion. Yeah. Once we see their beacon, we'll regroup by the river and escape on Freyr's boat. The whip! It's creating more! I see that. What are you doing? <clears throat> Break your mouth up. Break your mouth up. But there's more. They've 
rallied more soldiers since our last visit. Hmm. Our disadvantages are many. Yo, I'm gonna end this one off here. I know this is kind of a weird point, but I'm already short on time, and I know this is about to take forever with this annoying ass fucking thing. But no, he's coming out. But if you guys going to enjoy this video, make sure to like button down below, subscribe, and I'll see you guys probably later today for the next God of War video. Peace.